All right, my loyal subjects, welcome back. Feral Fiasco here for more Trails of Cold Steel. Uh, we just had our meet cute with uh, Elisa R. And let's go ahead and explore this starting town. Oh, I'm sorry. We're not quite ready to open for the day. <laughs> Please do stop by later, though. This cafe is pretty popular with Thor students, if I do say so myself. This cafe looks pretty nice. Seems like the perfect place to come and unwind a long day of classes. I'd have put an after there, but that's just me. What is this place? Kirsch's Cafe and Inn. Hmm. Good morning. You must be here for Thor's entrance ceremony today. <laughs> It's such a pleasure to see so many youngsters filled with hope and aspirations. I hope you will make the most of your time at the Academy. Thanks, old man Euler. Oh, are you one of Thor's new, uh, the new Thor students? My dad runs this store. He's got all sorts of things you might need for your studies. I hope you'll visit us if you ever need anything. Seems like he's raised a capable little worker. Brandon's General Goods. Sorry, we're still getting everything ready for business. I hope you'll come back once we're all set up, though. Sure, why not, Tizel? Class 7 Dormitory. I'm guessing this used to be one of the Academy's dorms? Looks vacant now. This will take me out to the highway. I really don't have time to leave Tom right now, though. Oh, hey. Very seamless, game designers. Uh, Trista home. Maybe I should go to the ancient ceremony instead of barging into strangers' homes. How come it's okay when Link does it, but suddenly when Reen tries it, uh, we have respect for people's personal privacy now. Mixed pawn shop. The door is locked. This looks like a pawn shop. Doesn't seem to be open right now, though. Oh, no, that is not a door. This must be the boutique. They've got quite the collection, and it's all stylish. Maybe I need to update my wardrobe. Haven't you heard, dude? School uniforms are the new all-purpose outfit. Oh hey, it looks like there's even a little park here. Seems like the perfect spot to catch a breather, what with all these shops around. Creeping on girls in the park. Mm. Not really, though. She shouldn't be sleeping there. Why is she sleeping here? Right? That's what I want to know. Is she a new student? She's got the uniform and all. The ceremony's going to be starting soon. Maybe I should wake her up. I better go. Alright. She's sure a strange one. Like a stray cat or something. If she's headed to the school, I'd say that's my cue to pick up the pace. Nah, we're fine. That's Euler. Have we talked to her yet? Oh. Spring's lovely hearing, Trista. The combination of the blooming lino flowers and soothing sunlight is very pleasant. And on top of that, it represents new beginnings. I hope you enjoy your time at the Academy. 
What's her name? Jane. Oh. Is this a shop? Jane's. The store is littered with all sorts of gardening tools and products. There doesn't seem to be anything for you to buy here. Yeah, probably not going to do too much gardening. Uh, that's Keen's bookstore. Maybe some chick. So that's Thor's military academy. It's right in front of me, but the idea of attending such a prestigious school still feels like a dream. Just thinking about it is getting me all nervous again. Talk to new student. Oh, she doesn't even get a name? Holy crap. Got some tykes. Annie. I'm playing with my brother today. Because he doesn't have any friends. Ouch. Emil? I'm a little jealous that you're a Thor student. I'd like to start attending high school as soon as possible, too. Playing along with the other children at Sunday school has gotten too boring for me. I don't know, dude. Well, I would never choose to go back to be a child, but it was okay for when it was a thing. Maybe I should go to the ancient ceremony instead of barging into strangers' homes. Again, why can't I do that? That's so weird that... Like, you can do that in all other kinds of JRPG games, but not this one. Suddenly you've got respect for people's homes, I guess. Uh, Rudy? Come on, Kay. You know there's more to school than just studying. Your dad's told you that over and over. Studying's a pain, but I'm sure there's enough fun stuff to make up for it. You gotta study, like, all the time in that fancy school you're at, don't you? Man, why would anyone want to go there? Because you get to be the main character in a JRPG? I'd say that's a pretty sweet deal. Well, no. JRPG main characters, unless you're the Persona 4 protagonist, because then you get a sweet deal. But otherwise, it's kind of lame. So this is the town chapel. Seems like it's about the same size as the one back home. pretty nice. And we've got Gaius, who's apparently pretty pious. Pious Gaius? Yeah, that's not a thing. Let's not make that a thing. Plus he's got like weird tattoos? And sandals? Oh, I guess someone's already here. Hmm? Sorry, am I in your way? Oh, no, not at all. Good, good. If you'll excuse me then. Alright. Cool guy Gaius. That's one tall guy. And judging by his complexion, I don't think he's from Marabonia. But he's wearing a red uniform too. Just like me and that girl. Oh well. While I'm here, I might as well get in a prayer for the start of the school year before I take off. What are you... Father Paulo? Welcome, young one. This is Tristic Chapel, where we pay respect to the goddess Idios. Another new Thor student, I see. Oh, Idios, please grant these students a fruitful youth. Well, I feel blessed, I guess. So, Idios is the god, goddess, in this game. Entrance ceremony starting soon, isn't it? Well, I'm sure you're nervous. There's no need to worry. Idios will guide you along the right path. But if you ever need any advice or assistance, our door is always open. Thanks. I'm sure I'll be fine without Idios, but thanks. Oh, there's no one in here? This is probably Father Paulo's uh, study or whatever. Oh, door closed. Can I? Oh, no. Standing there watching doors close. Should probably be on my way. Uh, I came from that way. Down there. There's like a pier or something over there. Uh. Cutscene time. Cool. 
I shall take my leave here, milady. I pray you find victory here in both your studies and your training. Laura, I think that is. Thank you, Klaus. Yes. I'm leaving everything in your hands while Father is away. Understood, milady. Those lace-up boots, though, must be a pain to put on. Oh, please excuse my rudeness, young sir. Sure, I'm not sure how you are being rude here. It truly is a splendid day, is it not? The start of a new chapter in the lives of so many promising youths. Allow me to express my sincerest congratulations on your admittance into this fine academic institution. Thanks. Oh. Thank you very much. Right? So I'm not sure how he was being rude to me when I was like eavesdropping on their conversation. I'm guessing he's a butler? He certainly looks the part. Did he have a name? I don't know if he had a name. That means the girl with him must be, uh, oh, that means the girl with him must have been a noble. She did have a certain dignity about her. I wonder if she's from a famous military family or something. Uh, there's a guy. Lower class dorm, all right. Seems like this is one of the academy's dorms. I think it's a bit too early for me to go in though. Yo, new kid, you're in the wrong spot. How the hell do you even end up here? It's a straight shot to the academy. You better get your ass in gear. You don't want to be late on your first day, do you? It, yeah, thanks. I, I think he's trying to be friendly? Maybe. Well, overly friendly, but he's in the lower class dorms. He's lower class. We don't have to worry about that joker. So these are probably where the important people who aren't the scum of the earth live. Yep, upper class dorm. Seems like this is one of the academy's dorms. I think it's a bit too early for, uh, to be wandering inside, though. The Lino flowers are so pretty. <laughs> they serve as such a perfect complement to the entrance ceremony. I'll be looking forward to seeing this year's batch of upper class students. Yeah, she's like, F the lower class kids, no one cares about those jokers. Uh, so we had Gaius and Laura and Silver Hair Girl, who is V. Is that it for the cameos? Probably. Oh, one more? So this is it. Oh, this is the school itself. Thor's Military Academy. Kind of looks like a church, but I'm digging the blue and silver look. Benches and stuff. Military Academy. I wonder if there are any schools in America that look like this. Probably. I know my college. My college certainly wasn't this Founded big. By the legendary Emperor Dracos himself. My first high school probably would have been closest. Super limousine that can climb stairs. Wait, did I come upstairs or did Thank I walk you up here? Patience, sir. We've arrived at the academy. Much obliged. Juices. Juices is such a dumb name, dude. Please, if you'll allow me to take your luggage. That won't be necessary. I prefer to avoid standing out too much. Already completely failed there, I assure you. This isn't open for debate. Alright. Take whatever rest you need, then return to Berea Hard. As you wish, I shall be departing, sir. May your time spent in these hallowed halls be all you've hoped for. Please take care of yourself. Hey, the limousine driver cares, dude. That's 
That's pretty cool. Seriously, are there stairs back there or what? Wow. An Orbal limousine. And one of Rainford's fanciest models, too. Looks like even Erebonia's upper cr Ooh. Looks like even Erebonia's upper crust send their children here. Hmm. Welcome to Thor's Military Academy. Thank you, little girl. You're... let's see... Yes, you're the last of them. That'd make you... Breen Schwarzer, right? Uh, yes, that's me. It's a pleasure to meet you. You should know a lot but of stuff. How do you know me? Right? <laughs> it's a long story. I'm sure it's not that long. Don't sweat the details right now. I'm sweating them. Is that your weapon you've got wrapped up? I'll need to hold on to that for the time being. Oh, right. It mentioned something about that in the guidebook. Reen handed his bag to the boy, even though there's like a good foot? There's like a good foot of airspace between him and the actual bag, but whatever. Thanks. We should be able to return it to you before long. You'll hardly even miss it. The entrance ceremony is going to be held in the auditorium. Just head straight back. You can't miss it. Anyway, I hope you enjoy your first day at Thor's. We're glad to have you. I hope these next two years will be a fruitful time for you. Two years? I guess those two must be second years? That girl definitely looked younger than me, though. And what was that about me being the last? I'm not seriously the very last student to check in, am I? Are we already juniors? Sounds like it's about time for the ceremony to start, though. Well, here's to the start of a great two years. Because I know in Japan, it's you get three years in high school, and if there's only two years left, that would make us juniors. And if they're second years, that means they're in their last year? Now, what? if I may, I'd like to say a few words in closing about this Academy's illustrious history. Principal Van Dyke. Thor's Military Academy was founded almost 220 years ago. Its founder, as I'm sure you're all aware, was none other than the great Emperor Dreykos. The very same Emperor who ended the War of the Lions and returned prosperity to the Erebonian Empire. Thirty years after becoming Emperor, in the later years of his life, he opened the doors of this institution. It was to be a place where young people like yourselves could learn the art of war. Little odd, but okay. Young but soldiers. with the mechanization of the military, many of our graduates now pursue careers outside the army. So our our mission, system? however, remains the same to prepare our students to fulfill Emperor Dreykel's famous mandate. Arise, O oh youth, and become the foundation of the world. Though much has happened these past two and a quarter centuries, the world is still the domain of the young. Yet still the question remains, what qualities must one possess to become a part of its foundation? I hope this credo will serve as a guide and an inspiration to you during your two years at this academy. Seriously, how old are we supposed forth, to be? My students, the world awaits the great things you will one day accomplish. The foundation of the world, huh? <laughs> no pressure, right? 
<laughs> no kidding. Though, this is Dracos the Lionheart we're talking about. He didn't earn his nickname by taking the easy road. Guess we've got more to worry about than just passing exams, huh? <laughs> I guess we do. Elliot Craig. I'm Elliot Craig. Nice to meet you. Reen Schwarzer. Hey, looks like we're sporting the same school fashion. Yeah, no idea what the red uniform is supposed to mean, though. Most of the other students are wearing green. Well, except for the ones in the white uniforms. Those must be the nobles. Looks that way. Though... Yeah. Pretty fancy. Hmm? Something wrong? Nah. Just thinking to myself. And that brings us to the close of Thor's 215th entrance ceremony. Next, please proceed to the class designated in your guidebook. There, you will go over the school rules as well as your class's curriculum. That is all. Dismissed! Alright, cool. Assembly's over, the boys and girls. designated in our guidebook? I don't remember seeing anything like that. There wasn't any information on that in mine, either. I just assumed they'd tell us where to go after the ceremony. All right! Students in red uniforms, if I can have your attention, please. Sounds like Tomo from Madoka. By now, you're probably all confused. Where's my class assignment, you're probably thinking? That's perfectly understandable. Your situation is a little more complicated than the other students. But before I explain, I'd like all of you to join me for a special orienteering exercise. What? Did you mean an orientation exercise? She said what she meant, bro. Mm. Worry not. Everything will be made clear soon enough. Now, right this way, if you would. Um... Looks like we're gonna have to follow her if we want any answers. <sighs> I'm fine with answers myself. What do you think this is all about? I have no idea, but we're not going to accomplish anything just standing around here. We should go with her. Hmm. Into the great gray beyond. There's nothing beyond those doors, guys. I agree, noble-looking boy. Awfully sus about the red students. Okay. Dark Thor's Academy Old Schoolhouse. What is this place? Right? Why is there a building this dilapidated on campus? It looks like it should have been torn down ages ago. Hey now, let's not discriminate against old looking buildings. Humming. Alright. Right? What does she want us to do here? Follow her? Is she ever gonna tell us what's going on? I suppose we'll just have to go inside and see for ourselves what awaits us. Alright. And we're going to go ahead. We'll see what's inside and awaits us next time on Trails of Cold Steel. I will actually see you guys, my loyal subjects, next time.